I want to introduce a landmark new feature in Safari Montage that embraces a common user workflow to save you time. If you've ever found a great educational resource on the web and wanted to make certain that you have access to it for instruction in the future, you know that saving it to the right place for future access is the key. Now, with one click, you can save the link with its metadata and ingest the resource link directly into the Learning Object Repository, assuming you've already logged into Safari Montage. The Safari Montage Chrome Browser extension, which in effect is a magical little SM button for your Chrome browser, makes adding web and online resources to your Safari Montage lore easier than ever. If you're on YouTube and you find a video you'd like to use later in Safari Montage, you can simply tap the new SM button on your Chrome Browser Extension toolbar. This will ingest the YouTube video link URL into My Files or My Locker, along with metadata for title, upload year, YouTube channel name, and the published thumbnail of the video. This linked YouTube video can then be shared in the lore in an education-friendly presentation, added to playlists, and benefits from Safari Montage's trusted domain status to playback content even when the district blocks student YouTube access. The new link can also be found in search results under the Web Streaming Video tab. The same goes for browsing the web. When you find content you want to add to the lore, you can use the SM button to ingest the URL and its metadata and create a thumbnail for the page. The link is then available to share, add to playlists, and further tag for subsequent discoverability. Note that if the site requires a user to log in and is not an established LTI single sign-on site, the user would have to sign in manually when trying to access the page. Now let's say you're online in your Google Drive, where you have stored documents, slides, spreadsheets, and so on. You can now easily ingest a Google Drive resource into the lore for local management and sharing. And you have the option of doing this in one of two ways. You can add the Google Drive link for future collaboration, or save the full converted file in Microsoft Office or PDF formats. In addition, Google Slides can be converted to slates during the ingestion process. The system auto-detects the type of file that's being ingested and customizes the lore upload options accordingly. Okay, so how do you get the Safari Montage Chrome Browser extension? First, you need to know that it's available with Safari Montage version 7.4.50 or later. And you may even have it already, if your system admin has enabled the feature. Check your Chrome browser to see if the SM button appears in the toolbar. If it does, you're good to go. If you don't see the SM button, check in with your system admin or IT team to see if your system is set up for this tool. If so, they can install it or show you how to do it yourself. You just need the Chrome browser and a Google user account configured for sign in with Google. We think this new Chrome browser extension is a game changer, really streamlining the workflow for adding great online resources to the Safari Montage lore.